And welcome back to another awesome episode of the Careful Boys, where we are currently. Oh, off for the off the record with all nice. Anthony Day. Nice. Oh, nice. We're Anthony. off the record. <laughs> and there's no way. There's no way we're not acknowledging our amazing guest, Hannah. Yeah. Hannah. Wow. Doing my best. Trying really hard. Do you like that intro song? Got an impromptu. Uh, have it. some fun with this. Uh, oh yeah. She's like this. We got this in Mexico together. Oh yeah, we did. You, you could have stopped this and you didn't. Yeah. <laughs> she encouraged it. <laughs> yeah, I they were agree. doing it at Chichen Itza, and she goes, yeah. "Oh, you want to get one?" And I'm like, "She goes, I know you want one." And I was like, "It made oh, him so happy." And I, was, <laughs> and I was doing that all day. I feel like nobody does it quite like you. You know, what I would love to do for the fans. I'm, I'm just gonna just go on a whim here. I'm gonna do go it. ahead and request to switch seats with Joe for a second because we want to get them in the same frame. Yeah. Oh. Lovers, a bunch of lovers. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Cause we I don't know what's happening. We just we just gotta endorse this chemistry. There's no way we're not gonna have him. Your ass is warm. Oh really? This your ass is Now yours warm. is too. Yeah, yours is actually not that warm. Yeah. Why is this so <laughs> regular the, cold? So what does this it's mean? <laughs> it's all the ice training. You know? All right, so we're gonna go into a, a session of couples counseling for these two. Oh. And I just wanna make sure everybody's got their questions and their advice. We're on the verge of breaking Ready, up. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so uh, let's just, just start with a couple yeah. basic questions. <laughs> I want you guys both uh, answer at the same time. Don't look at each other or anything like that. We're just gonna ask some basic questions. I'm gonna count down three, two, one, and then you both have to answer immediately. Let's just see okay. if we're on the same page, okay? Okay. 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 And um, let's make it easy. Do you want children? Yes. yes. I said I'm gonna <laughs> count down. Okay, cool. Well, we're it's off our, to our, a good our, start, guys. Yeah. Right. Now, how about this? Um, um, Joe's just gonna say yes. All right. Three, two, how many children? Three, two, one, go. Three. three. Is, that's four. very good. Yeah. Okay, wow. and uh, what uh, biological gender first, girl or boy? Three, two, one, go. No matter. I say girl first. Okay. Oh. <laughs> like I can choose it. Yeah. Is there a reason why you want a girl first? I think the dynamic with an older sister is good. Mmm. I think. How so? I see what you mean. I think girls I think, take care of the the whole. Yeah. I think so too. Mm. I think, yeah. like, based on my experience. The, it's a different relationship between an older sister and younger siblings to an older brother and younger Did you have, is, the, is your oldest sibling a uh, male or female? Male. So I've got an older brother and then- So you're saying like based on my experience, I wish it was the other way. Did you feel like you had an extra parent than a brother? No. Because we're very close in brother, age. Like yeah. we've only like, I think my mom had all of us, four kids in like four and a half years. So wow. The age isn't like big enough for it okay. to be. But I felt like me and my mom's relationship I like. Mm. Cool. I think a girl would be good for slavery reasons. Mm. That's good. Because um, she... Expand on that. <laughs> what if you just stop? Yeah. For slavery reasons. Next, Next question. question. <laughs> Next question, unanimously. And don't ask me about that. <laughs> Moving on. Because yeah. girls, they'll take care of the kids. <laughs> okay. okay. Wow. So it was actually on brand. Exactly what we thought. Because uh, okay. they'll treat them like uh, dolls. I did that. Okay. Who is more sexually dominant? Three, two, one, go. Me. Yeah, you. Yeah, you. Probably. There was a little hesitation there. I think it depends on the day. Sexually. That's true. Okay, then who is more sexually creative? Three, two, one, go. Me. Mm. Oh. oh. No, actually, to be fair. No. I think what's I lean into it more, but you come up with the idea. How, okay, so what's what? How are you more creative? I don't know. Like, who's down to do weirder stuff? Yeah, I think he comes up with ideas. Like what? Like outfits and things like that. <laughs> <laughs> I like enact it. What kind of outfits? She's wearing an octopus costume. <laughs> <laughs> she's wearing a Pikachu fucking costume. It's like unsexy. <laughs> but she's like a fashion designer, so she made it herself. You know, it's like right. personal. It could be a capy like bar. characters <laughs> or lingerie. Both. Both. But I think like he comes up with the ideas. And then I, like, I like an actor. Four limbs. I don't know. Know. What are you talking about? Yeah. Octopus? Yeah. Cool. They only have four limbs. Sometimes I like to structure it out too. Like I like a to-do list of stuff. Oh, like, just a this, check, then this, sex checklist. What's like a what's like a I like a her sex checklist. Because we're gonna take a bath, she goes, I'ma scrub you, and after that yeah. I'm gonna come over here, I'm gonna lick your balls first, I'm gonna do that, yeah. and I'll be like, I that's like a dope checklist. Do you guys ever use food? 
in sex. No, because I don't like food in bed. Because I like food in bed. Oh, that's right. That's continuing issue for us. <laughs> so, yes. you, so you would like to use food, but he doesn't like. I ain't gonna food. use whipped cream so to eat. Do it on the couch. Yeah, I don't need that shit, huh? I feel like I would get more. Naked beer. sushi man. <laughs> oh, dude, that would be amazing. <laughs> They get sashimi right, You guys just turn into like having a dinner instead yeah. of sex. <laughs> oh yeah. We yeah. just eat strawberries and we just end up like, let's put on a show. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. These strawberries yeah. are good. What city do you ultimately want to settle down? Three, two, one. Three cities ish. Ooh. No, three city. Wait, three cities? What, what city? What city? I don't know if it's like. I think ultimately we'll stay in America. Probably. Oh really? I think so. <laughs> oh really? I, I think. Oh, wait, you, you sound like you have a thought out. How come you said, oh, really? <laughs> yeah. He will go with what I want. Oh, Ultimately, I think. Oh, he's like, oh, really? <laughs> I think he would. I feel like you've always talked about, like, in the UK for the healthcare. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Well, I think I would pop. Well, so, right, my thinking is <laughs> that I think he wouldn't be as happy in the UK mm. as. Because the weather? Because his I friends are here. Friends, like, family. And I think, like, I like it here. I feel like I fit in. Yeah. Yes. 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 <laughs> yes. <laughs> like, I don't These assholes know. don't. Yes. <laughs> I don't know how you would do in, in the UK. I think people would like you, but I mean, as in, like, I don't know how you would like I have it. friends there, and I make friends I way quicker than you do. You do, but I think knowing. But yes, I would miss yes, my friends here. I think so. I, for me, the, the reason why I answered the way I, I did is because. It's <coughs> in different stages of my life, oh, yeah. it will be dependent on that. So like, I could totally imagine being there if bit. we have kids for a moment. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Because, yeah. Kids for a moment. Because, because like, well, depending on what age. abandon them. Yeah. Oh, One's right, 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 right. Yeah. <laughs> you're set them loose. She has a massive family, family and I'm, I'm sure your parents would want to be around them. Right, yeah. and then, oh, yeah. and then so, yeah, so that, that whole, that whole thing. But how long we'll stay there? Well, like my life goal has always been having several different places that I live seasonally. Yeah, I just want to convince some people in my family to come here. And that can happen too. Yeah, and take yeah. care of the kids and things like that. But we'll see what happens. But I haven't really I fell in time. love with the city yet yeah. to want to go, this is my place. Yeah, I kind of like going yeah. around. Because I could think about five years at a time, but that wouldn't be like my mm. 20 year place. I feel like you yeah. guys being nomads is like, definitely you guys. We're pretty nomadic. Yeah. All right, which accent would you like your children to have? Three, two, one. <laughs> I'm gonna say American passport, British accent. That's lit. <gasps> oh wow. I think that's how you get by Shut in up. life. That's tight. Yeah. That's fucking mad. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how we would do that. Yeah. Bonkers, mate. <laughs> I want them with a Chinese it's accent. Not <laughs> <laughs> it's not all <laughs> night. <laughs> Chinese accent, Vietnamese accent. <laughs> even they can't even come. I can't even see my own kids because it's so hard. Chinese accent, Vietnamese. Yeah. If you have a child, what genetic features do you want for your child versus the other? Oh. oh. Well, oh. mate. I mean, the sun is only getting closer, so they really can't have my skin tone. <laughs> Like that's just damn Joe's skin tone, okay. They just the need melanin. Closer. Like it's it's bad. I've got sun, I'm getting freckles. Yeah. Burned white. really quick, huh? Uh, yeah, we can't be doing with that. Um physical features, I don't care. I kinda think we're gonna have ugly kids. <laughs> like <laughs> like black hair but a red mustache. I don't know. I just got this feeling they're gonna be like good people, like funny. But I saw a picture of a Japanese ginger boy and that fool made me want to kick him in the stomach and run. <laughs> wait, well, oh, can you make oh, make their kid on the oh, app? Wait, wait, wait. Right. Well, you Ryan's guys, like, I'm gonna regret it. Food. Three yeah. to four kids, right? Yeah. Okay, so you got three to four chances. To <laughs> like, uh, it's a good odds. Good looking kid. Yeah. He's very symmetrical. <laughs> oh, we yeah. heard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially his penis. And his penis. But then <laughs> one of them's gonna have a worry dick. One of them's gonna have a two inch dick. Which one, you know? Yeah. <laughs> it's disaster. gonna be bad. <laughs> I think maybe. He's got more fashionable, like he's got the big mouth that's popular. How do you have a fashionable mouth? Oh, he's it's like, fashionable. Yeah, like, She's in fashion, dude. She knows what's up. Lip injections. Your guy's hair. baby's gonna have beautiful hair. Beautiful hair. Oh, oh for sure. The hair game is gonna be nice. Great idea. Yeah, hair game is gonna be like on point. I think he's more symmetrical than me. Yeah. So I would go more your. My face? Maybe. If it's a girl, I think. She would look better like you, not like me. Yeah. I, th I think you'd be a pretty girl. Right. Don't sell yourself short. Dude, interracial babies are always Say beautiful. Hello to Melvin Jitsukawa. 
now melting. See, do you see what I'm saying? Let me see. It's stuck in like the 70s. Whoa, why is it still super Asian? Yeah. It's just because it was a bad angle probably that he well, He was also sure. laughing. Yeah, 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 yeah. He was like. Wait, if, yeah, you, yeah, if yeah. you switched it and you did her photo. Start, yeah, yeah, start with her with photo that, and yeah, add okay, his yeah. genetics. That kid is kind of ugly. Start, yeah, do, do it over. <laughs> guy, yeah. It's a bad it angle. Do bro. it over, yeah. <laughs> that guy looks like he fucking has, he, he runs on a cart and has people sitting in the back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would prefer to have ugly kids. Why? Better character. Why? Yeah, and then they can sort it out when I they get that. older. Yeah. Like I mean, they can always get plastic surgery. Yeah, 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 it's gonna be great. Say your greetings to Sir William Jitsukawa. <laughs> oh, that guy's good looking. Whoa. Say that, that guy's very good looking. What's that expression? It's just eyes closed. It's He's about to sneeze. It's, it's an expression oh. of indifference to the world. It's a, it's, a, it's a weird expression, but that guy looks like a TikTok star. He looks like he's coming. Right? Expression like of indifference to, to the world. You're like, what do you think about the political climate? I don't care. I don't, I don't yeah. care. I don't. I literally, I literally oh don't care. But that kid's good looking, though. You might. The expression of indifference I'm thinking to here. the world. <laughs> that kid is good looking. That's Peaky Blenders. He is, yeah. I can't remember where to lift my car in the car park. He looks like a TikTok star. Yeah. Don't wear his glasses. Oh, he he looks like he's saying, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> I mean, that's fine. I don't care. I, yeah, I'd rather than be ugly anyway. This, a gerbil? Nice. Right there. Oh, I didn't yeah. notice. Cool. Okay, um, how about this? Uh, who, in your opinion, would be a bad, better parent during the uh, child years versus the uh, teen or adult, young adult years? Oh, I'm definitely gonna be better when they're younger. Well, it depends but, on what. But I think you're a better. I think you're gonna be like a good parent when they get to like a little bit older. Why? I, think, I just yell at them and you can't. Yeah, I think I'm a lot softer, <laughs> oh. and I feel like I'll do better when they're like babies. The nurture part of it. Yeah, mm. but then I think like it gets to a point where he'll need to take over and actually get them to be adults. Well, at least you got both fronts covered instead yeah. of both of you being on the same side. Because I think yeah. One thing that I like. Um, uh, watching her do is interact with younger people and like also she's a kid magnet like every time immediately kids would just run up to her and like touch her hold her all this mm -hmm. stuff and it's the weirdest thing Aww. like recently oh you know Justin Chan I, yeah. I ran into him at Costco because we were just hanging out oh he lives in Hawaii yeah. he lives in Hawaii now and then like out of nowhere right his daughter wants to hug her and then just yeah. and then it's always <laughs> yeah. like this she's like a kid magnet okay. and then there's there's, it's funny because you know, like our friends' kids will be like playing with us, and she the, like one might be scared of me, but not even to her. So it's yeah. like, but I think that's developed over time too. I feel like your body gets you ready for it. Mm. Like I'm giving off some sort of like pheromone. Pheromone. Yeah. Yeah. Like, oh. yeah, that's like she needs to. Or they just think you're like a princess figure. I would like to believe that. Mm. I just don't think it's true. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice idea. But also the way that you speak to and like talk to like some of the uh you know employees and stuff and like just watching the interaction how you oh, teach yeah. and how i'm like oh, okay i can kind of see how you will treat younger people and as a parent and i'm like that's that's good you're very nurturing it's very different from me because i'm like fair. i'm always trying to make people sink but that's i think you need <laughs> that though people. yeah she's like oh we need to do this and we need to do that and i'm like no no they need to learn yeah because they, they'll sink in this instance but they'll learn yeah whereas i'm more like and i'll fix laugh it for them. but that's how you're yeah. probably raised and stuff too huh i was raised neglected so yeah, it's like yeah. he, he wasn't raised, yeah, raised yeah. as much as yeah. just grew up yeah so sinking he's more braised yeah <laughs> braised <laughs> that's a good team good balance and yeah, good chemistry. yeah yeah you probably need that right yeah yeah. But I, I, I don't think you do it too much though, because there's some people I think it's just so much to the point where it's overbearing. Mm. But you're not overbearing. I think you're like you care a lot and you try to fix it to the point, but you make the path too easy. So oh, then they don't. And also you try to cover, you try to fix it before it gets broken. messed broken. But I'm like that's a great experience for them to fuck up a little bit. Mm. Yeah. Right. Who's the messy one in the relationship? Three, two, one. Maybe I think me. we're. Both messy in different ways. Yeah, I think I'm messier than you actually. Yeah, that's a wild thing because they all know me as being fucked up. He's pretty like <laughs> clean in the house though. He got annoyed at me for not washing the dishes properly. I mean, if he doesn't want you leaving crumbs in the bed, it sounds. You know what I'm saying? You'd, you'd be messier. <laughs> yeah, I am 
yeah. messy in it. I mean, have you seen my office? Yeah, but, but you're like, a hoarder. That's what that is? That's yeah. what I am. I'm a world-class yeah. collector. Yeah, he collects, but I grew up in a bigger family, so I'm used to like a little mess. Uh, like, like it's manageable. Like, yeah, yeah just of, stuff around yeah, yeah. and things. Like not dirty, but just four kids in a house. Mm. But my know. recent like orderliness, that's a, a new part of my life. Oh really? Yeah, like it's very recent when my friend taught me how to design Darian. my room. Yeah, and then like now my room feels like art. So yeah. then I don't want to destroy it. Yeah. But before I never had that mentality. Mm. Everything looked like this office here. So if I'd have met you earlier, I could have yeah. been in the bed. All right, would you, would you guys? <laughs> so close. Would you guys do a, a prenup or no prenup? Three, two, one. No prenup. No prenup. <laughs> Tied. <laughs> Why is that funny to you? The, because she's the female. That's fucking funny, yeah, dude. <laughs> she's taking everything. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't have anything. You have that's actually that's why she's laughing and crying. Locked. I know what you've got. It's fine. You, got a bunch of you have a classic car that you could take and some stuff, maybe. I don't know. Pretty cool classic car. Take it's his paddleboard. I could, I know, I could, right? you could take, take back, back what you bought. For Just me. take the paddle. <laughs> make it useless. Secondhand paddleboard. Get that back. Yeah, just make it hurt. <laughs> yeah, no. Well, she told me she doesn't. Oh, uh, never mind. You find out that your uh, one of your children is uh, gay. Who's gonna take it better the first time around? I don't think Evers would give a fuck. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> I don't even think I don't even think they'd have to come out. Like, as in, I just think they could bring someone. They could be like, fabulous right out the puss, yeah, dude. Yeah, be tight. Straight up, like, hey, wow, wow. I don't even think it would. Be <laughs> all this, con okay, all this confetti know. comes out. <laughs> I'm born. <laughs> That's a sassy baby. You can stop pushing, lady. <laughs> <laughs> Took you long <laughs> enough. Yeah. You gonna cut this thing or? No. I love this, dude. Yeah. <laughs> That's the umbilical cord. <laughs> yeah. I think there's very little we would care about. Yeah, I haven't really put much thought into like, I don't know, I think like I would say a decade ago, I'll be like, oh yeah, you know, when I get my kid, I'm gonna be like this and this. And mm -hmm. I had all these like ways of controlling a mini version of me. But then now I'm just like, that's a lot of effort to put a lot of your expectations into another human being. Just like, yeah. let them born and, and hopefully, you know, you can make sure that they stay alive and then they have a good set of foundations. That's a good goal. <laughs> you know, of like, know. like and, 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 and yeah, and then yeah. they just get the love that they need in a good environment. And I mean, what else, you know, as long as, I don't know. So what's a deal breaker for both of you in this relationship? Um, um deal breaker? I would oh, We were talking about this the other day. Yeah. I and, don't know. I don't know, yeah. I don't I don't like the I, idea of like ultimatums of like if you do this, this is going to be the consequence because you don't know it depends on the situation in the moment. For me, like, it's smelly pussy, but really, you gotta keep that shit clean. Yeah, or else I'm running. Right. That's why he made you shower the first time, <laughs> dude. Yeah, just as like, more, like just in case. He's like, we're not ruining this. Oh, Any opportunity. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm, just kidding, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. It's a good boundary. Yeah, yeah. that's fair. Say smelly dick. Well, I could deal with a lot, to be fair. Asymmetrical shower. <laughs> oh, that is a deal breaker. If anything happens to that, two yeah. inches. She says, <laughs> she says I could even cheat, and she won't even leave me. What I said. Cool. Oh, 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 it doesn't sound like it should be that broad. No, I did say that because I. Because I'm like, oh, yeah. who am I gonna fuck next? But then it's not cheating. It's like I know. So my thing is, I don't believe in saying this is the only outcome to that solution. Mm. So like, if he did that, there would be a reason for it, right? That's like a symptom. It's not the cause. He's horny. If that was literally it, and then we weren't fucking. But then if, I think if he was horny beyond what we were doing, he should tell me about it and then we can arrange something. Yeah, because then the issue is communication. Yeah, then the issue is communication, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I think like, The issue is always deeper, yeah. yeah. And then it depends I on, so it's not gonna be like, I'll break up with you because of the cheating. It might be I'm breaking up with you because of the reasoning. Or it would be like, oh, that doesn't matter. That's just a symptom. Let's deal with the cause. Mm. But yeah. what if you caught him cheating mm. uh, with like, mm, I don't know, like Bart? And he just like, he was just yeah. like, saw that coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> I think that would, because Geo's hot, I think we could make that work. Like, just all move in together. That's very just equal the plane. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I get to see Tycho more. <laughs> God. I got two daddies and two mommies. 
like you guys' way of telling me something. Yeah. <laughs> I got four parents. <laughs> yeah, he would as well be in school like, I got two moms. So if Joe like murdered somebody, would you help him cover it up? Why did he kill them and who did he kill? Ah. Oh. Because that would depend. Your mom. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. What well, I had to make it like realistic. Yeah, something yeah. that would be a little She's bit like, more like. She's like, what did she do? Yeah, if it was a stranger, she'd be like, I don't give a fuck. Was it like an accident? Or what did he, he maliciously just hate that bitch? They never got along. <laughs> and he was just like, we cannot be together because she will never <laughs> approve. Approve of Have we got kids at this point? Um, no. Oh, no kids. I'm How old more is my dispensable. Mom? Because if she's on the way out anyway, <laughs> like if she's got five- No, it's <laughs> happening like tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Oh. oh. Shit, babe. Yeah, that might be it. I mean, your dad and brothers might kill me before you Yeah, do. I don't even think we should get so, chance. Oh, that's right. What, yeah. what if he, what if he kills like a, like a server at a restaurant because they were being too mean and they overcharged him for something and he just snapped? He just snapped? Yeah. Well, then we gotta get him counseling. But would you, would you turn him in? Oh no. <laughs> no. So nobody That's else right in the answer. restaurant saw. Yeah, no, no, no but because like... he's sneaky. He's sneaky about okay, it. Okay, what about oh, this? Okay. Yeah. What if it was a situation like Joe gets pulled over, mm. and then it's like an angry cop or something mm. for some reason he pulls a gun out, mm. right? He pulls a gun out. Joe thinks he can handle the situation, so he's like, "Wait, what the fuck?" Like he can. Joe already feels like his life is in danger, right. so he tries to like pull the gun out of the, the cop's hand. They get into a wrestling match, mm -hmm. and Joe accidentally kills the cop. Oh, yeah. Joe freaks out, oh fuck, because he knows what happens to the news. Mm -hmm. So he starts driving away. On the news, Joe's a wanted man, like oh, like uh, America's number one wanted person. Yeah. He comes home, you've been watching the news, he comes in, Yeah. he goes, babe, we're going to fucking Mexico. Mm. Do you go, what do you do? Do you just follow him to the end of the earth? Bart's like, all right, so chapter one, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And things that never will happen. <laughs> I'm thinking. Do you do? Do you like go? No, wait. We gotta think. Or do? You, are you? Do you just follow? Or do you wait for know. season two to yeah. find out where the plot goes? Yeah. We go to Mexico and work it out there. Surely, right? Because there's no way he's getting out of that. Like if you kill. I'm not coming camera, back to America. It depends if you get a good lawyer. Do you know what I mean? There's ways we can maybe work it out. But you go to Mexico and work it out there. Right? Yeah, but wait, you've they, already fleed, so already they extradite they Mexico to America, though. Uh, then you keep going, so yeah, keep, keep going. going dude. Yeah. Then maybe we yeah. hide, good lawyer, and then I guess I don't know. Work out how to wire you money in prison. Is that what you do? Jeez. Guess you'll figure it out. I mean, that says a lot. That says enough that you're willing yeah. to go that length. Yeah, that's right. really cool. How long did you go to prison for that? Am I allowed to like, if you went to I'm prison innocent. for like a long time, am I allowed to fuck Yeah, Joe's people? technically innocent, it's just the- oh, If you go to a prison yeah. for a long time, am I allowed to fuck other people? She's Yesterday like, you said that if I died, you wouldn't fuck nobody. But if you're in jail, it's different. And I told you, I told you you should sure. fuck somebody. <laughs> Yesterday you said if I died, you wouldn't fuck nobody. <laughs> I was at lunch, was too. Was morning <laughs> conversation? How do you, how do you just start fun. saying that? I think we were there. <laughs> you guys have had some crazy conversations in the last 24 hours. Right. Hypotheticals are fun, though. <laughs> The one we keep having is like, he oh, wants to, if he's in hospital and he's like in a coma and there's no coming back, Kill me. he wants me to switch off the machine. Yeah, that's hard though. Would, you think you could do that? <laughs> and then the joke oh, is, you're I'm gonna, gonna bark, everyone's yeah. gonna be saying goodbyes while Bart just walks up and unplugs it in the middle of yeah. it. And he's like, what, you guys yeah. taking too long? Because I couldn't do that. And then one tear from Bart and he just leaves. Yeah. <laughs> he just walks out like, what are you doing? <laughs> how, how long though, like? Not just, not like 12 hours, right? 12 hours of coma? <laughs> it's gotta be like a week or something. He just got in. Yeah. You get the call, like, he, he just got into oh, the hospital. Okay, <laughs> okay yeah. <laughs> he would, it'd be me rugby tackling Bart. Like, it's only been an hour. And the well, it's like, we've talked about this. <laughs> <laughs> and the doctor said there's a 90% chance of surviving. <laughs> there's a 90%. He said what he said. And sometimes you see Joe go, Bart <laughs> <laughs> just goes, yank. Yeah, but, but the first plug is like to a lamp, so like you're okay. To the calendar. Bart's like, oh shit, wrong plug. Yeah, oh shit, the light went off. Oh, this is the one, right? Why does this place have so many outlets? Yeah. I might fuck like a prostitute or something. But I'm still alive! In prison? No, I said if I die. Oh, if you die? In prison? <laughs> Conjugal <laughs> visits! Why is it that if I die, you won't fuck anybody? But if I'm still alive, you will still fuck? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense that to me! That feels like, because one, I can ask you permission. Yeah. I mean, permission, yeah. permission. Permission, permission. And you're fucked. 
Yeah, but I'm a go. I'm dead. You don't have to fuck. You don't know, have. What if you're like stood in the room watching me get railed by some other guy? Is that not gonna make you sad? No, cause I gave you permission. I'm dead. Oh, I know I can't dead. bang you anymore. So I'm like, I'm dead. I'll fuck some ghost girls or some <laughs> shit. You're gonna fuck ghost girls? Yeah. Oh. So like. So, so I'm still a girl. Ghost girl. <laughs> With me in your afterlife, you're gonna go off and fuck a bunch of ghosts. No, girls. I'm saying that if I'm dead, we can't even cross path in the same dimensions. No. So go fuck whoever you want. If you die and you don't haunt me, I'm gonna be pissed. Yeah, but if I <laughs> I'll haunt you, but I'm fuck I'm getting some ghost pussy. Cause that's a different dimension. Yeah. Do you think you can feel it? Role. Yeah, I mean we're in the same dimension. That's I'm really uh, hurt by that. Let's go the rules of ghosts. What doesn't make sense is I get a traffic ticket, I get I go to fucking jail, and you're already banging a prostitute. You killed a cop in his world. Traffic ticket. <laughs> this scenario is realistic Why? and I love it. Prison for two weeks and I'm like, I need to get some. <laughs> and I come out like, what the fuck? You guys I get asked. each other for real. <laughs> but if he's a ghost, you're like betrothed forever. Yeah. No. If I'm dead and the ghost, he's like, I'm never having dick ever again. But what if like, like I get a I DUI? I don't even drink alcohol. I'm in, I'm in prison for like a week, and you're like, I fucked five hookers. And I'm but like, what happens God, if, like damn. I meet another guy, <laughs> and then we're God. together, and then in my next life, I find him and not you. Oh. See. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Right? Damn. Check and mate. Yeah. Thank you. That is true. That's a good point. Wow. Yeah. That's a golf clap right there. <laughs> wow. I never thought of that. I never thought about it. You reincarnation thinker.